morning everyone it's doggy and we're here today to do something out of the ordinary it's see next month is November and here in America where I'm from it's almost election day so with that in mind I got this little thing here th this little quiz sent to me via email and I just just decided to check it out and it looks interesting what I don't get it's from the Hispanic section and and I'm not Hispanic I wonder wh I wonder why they did that anyways this is can you pass the new citizenship test take the challenge an official test well I don't know it's 30 questions so I decided to show you a little bit of the quiz so you can learn a little bit about America if you don't if you you're not sure yet because you know I have plenty of well plenty of YouTube viewers are around the world aside from America so I thought this would be interesting to show and also I don't I mentioned before that I want to do something based on knowledge so here we have it so okay, here's the good news and here's the bad news uh, uh, sorry I have a little bad news just bad news bad news is I did this quiz before and I know all the right answers so I might pretend that I get it wrong or whatever but anyways let's get started question number one what type of economic system does the US have a capitalist economy or free market B traditional economy C I think that's Marxian I'll, I'll just say Marx Marx socialism uh, Marx social socialism the democratic socialism <clears throat> well is it a yes it's a capitalist economy also known as the free market it's an economic system in which the means of production are owned by private persons which is us I believe and operated for profit where investments distribution income production and pricing of goods and services are predominantly determined through the operation of a free market rather than by central economic planning I'm gonna openly admit this and I don't want any kind of American insults that I'm kinda have a weakness in e uh, economy for some reason I guess I'm very forgetful but I'll work on it oh when is the last day this is number two when is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms hmm okay I'm gonna here's some fun I'm gonna close my eyes just pick one a by February 15th of every year by March 15th of every year by April 15th or by May 15th let's see A B C D oh I can't okay let's just try D oops April 15th the last day to file forms is April 15th if however you owe money you'll be penalized if you do not pay what you owe by April 15th no matter if you file I'm on in number three America should know this in which month do we vote for president? A. January B. April C. September D. November It is D. November next month I just said it United States presidential election of 2008 scheduled for Tuesday November 4th 2008 will be the 50, 56th consecutive quadrennial United States presidential election and we will select the president and vice president of the United States 
Um, also, if you don't mind, I don't want any political discussions on my channel or my movies. Because, you know, I, I will say this. The thing is, it's just very... Okay, what are two major political parties in the U.S. today? That would be Democratic and Republican. Very easy. Democratic Party is one of the two major political parties, the other being Republican. The Republican Party is the oldest in the United States and among the oldest in the world. Yep. And it's very simple. Democrat, Republican. I think. Yeah. Like I said, it's political discussion is very provocative, so Although I don't, I'm not into, I'm not inclined to one party, you can speak to me easily, but, because I'm still slightly learning, but it's really, you get flamed by others, so I want you to be careful when it comes to speaking out on these things. Number five, how long do we elect the members of the House of Representatives? Uh, two years, three years, four years, five years. That should be two. Yep! Every two years! Two chambers, United States Congress, the House was granted of exclusive powers, powers to initiate revenue bills. This is important! The House granted its own exclusive powers, the power to initiate revenue bills, impeach officials, and elect the president in electoral college deadlocks. And that's the Speaker of the House. What two representative bodies make up the Congress? The Judicial Branch Executive, House of Representatives, Ministry of Defense, Supreme Court, and Senate, Senate, House of Representatives. That is D. Senate, House of Representatives, is the Congress. Yes. Let's speed things up a bit. What is the name of the president's official home? <laughs> a. The executive house. B. The presidential palace. C. The presidential house. D. The white house. I pick B. I'm kidding. The white house. White house formerly known as the executive mansion is the official residence and principal workplace of the president. Yep. Number eight. What do the stripes on the flag represent? The red and white stripes. And the original A, original 13 colonies that rebelled against the British crown. Crown, I'm sorry. 13 English men that first arrived on U.S. soil. 13 months it took American colonists to defeat the British and claim liberty. 13 original Indian tribes. I believe it's A. Yay! Thirteen, the original thirteen colonies. Yes, the first, the first states. And also called... Oh, shoot. Okay. Fifty stars are the U.S. states, and the thirteen stripes represent the original... Yes, thirteen colonies. Yes. This wasn't there. Uh, shoot. Okay, never mind. Name... One, responsibility that is reserved only for United States citizens. That free tickets to go to the country that he or she was born. Go to the university or obtain federal government jobs. Vote or serve on a jury. D. Mm -hmm. Adult citizens or U.S. who are residents of one of the 50 states have the right to fully participate in the political system of the United States. Citizens have the duty to serve in a jury if selected, and I have yet to do jury duty. Why not? Huh. Name two national U.S. holidays. Memorial Day, Congress Day, Thanksgiving, Columbus Day, Christmas, and Citizenship Day, Veterans Day, and Independence Day. I think I got this wrong before, and I think it's D. Yes. What did I pick the last time? I'm not sure. Oh, look! 